So you guys have a micro bus? We got a VW bus, yeah, 74. Cool. Is it psychedelically painted or anything? Oh, uh, not yet. I've only had it for about three weeks now. Yeah. So. What color is it? It's red and white. Yeah. So I've been decorating it at the shows, though. That was one of the things I wanted to do. So you've been getting, what, stickers and yeah, stuff? Yeah, things and, like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, is it a camper van or just a straight van? It's a straight van. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And uh, you're going to go with them out to the... I'm going to go with them, uh, report back from the parking lot. Uh, Shemp was out there earlier, mm -hmm. and I heard a little bit about what was going on there. So now it's time for me to tap in, I guess. Are you, you're not going to the show tonight? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't go. Okay. All right. Gary, I'm a meat eater, and uh, I, I, don't, I don't feel that I'll fit in, quite frankly. I think that they'll know that. I think oh, they'll test the me. There's business who's out there, Steve. Yeah. You know, walking around, I was talking to him. Yeah, well, there, there's Everybody a lot of guys now that used to look like, uh, what's, what's your name again? I'm sorry. I'm Jeff. Jeff, you're the guy who looks like I used to look. There, there are a lot of guys who used to look like that back in the late 60s now that work for IBM and drive their BMWs right. out there. So. <laughs> and they have the, uh, the, the sticker on the, on the bumper. On the yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Yeah. The which skull cool. with the which lightning is, bolt which is in cool. it. cool. Yeah. I mean, if you can make it all work, that's great, you know? I mean, I still manage to make most of it work myself. Mm -hmm. I just don't look the same, although I don't exactly look normal. True. You no, know? you're... <laughs> Comparatively speaking. You fit a profile. I'm going to the Abby Hoffman funeral tonight, guys. Yeah, uh, we I can't make about it. that this morning. That's sad. Yeah, what happened to him? Did he no, just they don't die know. of uh, they don't know. natural they causes? Or? Causes. Yeah. Maybe According... it's another one of his disappearing acts. McCarthyism. <laughs> it's that he's in an island somewhere in the Caribbean. No, I, I uh, had that same thought about somebody getting rid of him. But why would they do that at this point? I mean, all that stuff is way in the past. I never know. That's true. It's said in the newspaper. They don't it look like natural causes, but... Uh, he was depressed about a car accident he was in a couple months ago. They didn't elaborate on that, but that's mm. what it said in the paper. Okay. Well, I can find... I'll find out about that as I man the station here. You're welcome to go now if you want to go. I mean, I think you should. They're you here. You should get out there. Might as well. There's a lot of stuff out there to do. Now you have enough batteries and stuff? I don't know the technical aspect. Because I, I imagine you guys don't have a car phone. No. That no would right. be bogus. <laughs> oh, well. We'll provide all that. Yeah. I've got some uh, money for some T-shirts. All right. Maybe an LSD simulator. If I yeah. find one. Or maybe the real thing. Oh, I saw a good one yesterday. A simulator? Yeah. It's like a kaleidoscope. You put it over your eyes, and you blow in a little tube, and you have to close your eyes and look at the sun. And all these colors flash behind your eyes. Well, I used really? to do that in study hall. Sure. <laughs> you used to, you used to push, push your, like, the palms of your hands against your eyes, and you'd see those fireworks. Yeah. I used to do that all the time in study hall. It was really cool, but then by the end of study hall, boy, did I have a headache. Man. Yeah. But, yeah, I used to do that. That's how I spent most of my time in school, just kind of like trying to get myself to hallucinate the study hall. <laughs> and Maybe look how he turned know. out. See what happens when you do that? Yeah. Look how he turned out. You kids, I want you kids back in school right now. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to you. All, all right, right I'm well, going to head out. Yeah, get that all together. And then and, can, uh, uh, I'll report back when we're on the road. Mm -hmm. In the VW, in the uh, VW microbus. bus. <laughs> all right. Driven by? Jeff. 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 Matto. Matto? Matt. Matt O and Kurt. and Kurt. And Kurt. And let's see, Denise and Dave and... Uh, just Denise and Dave. Just Denise and Dave are with us, too. Okay. And uh, what's that? Does, De does Denise have a tie-dyed well, shirt on with there. no bra? Oh, Denise. Yeah, we gotta, no, we, we should bring Denise over. in. She's beautiful. <laughs> Denise. Is yeah, really you should bring her in, I think, before you go. Here. All right, let's go get her. For Uncle Steve. <laughs> these kids, I could teach these kids a thing yeah. or two about psychedelics. Maybe I better go with them. Uh, well, here I have she to is. learn. Here she is. Hi, how are you? Hi. Hi. I'm Gary. That's Steve. How are you? Nice, nice to meet you. So we're going to have some fun this afternoon, You'll right? be staying here with me, and then the guys are going <laughs> to go out to the concert, and then we'll go out there later no, in no. my micro bus. No, okay. Let me show you my micro bus. What's the story on uh, Jerry's acoustic set this weekend at Alpine Valley? Is that something you people will go up to see? Alpine. For <laughs> sure. I mean, when they break off and do an individual... Deal. Does oh, that sure, appeal man. to you? Mickey's doing some stuff. Yeah. You know, Mickey's doing some stuff in San Rafael. We're all going to that. It's for the Veterans Administration. You know about okay, that. Okay, so individually, the they're, they're strong in your eyes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, sure. All right. Have tie-dye, I will travel, dude. Got to. <laughs> you, you know, you're sticking out like a sore thumb right now, too. I know. And you're, uh, and you're black. But you do have your Levi's on. I've got in my... All right. And my boots are all beaten up. Oh, cool. Huh? I tried. I tried to dress. I tried. 
I want him in tie dye by the end of the uh, afternoon. Okay, that will be my yeah, mind. Yeah, <laughs> we'll be yeah. in tie dye with the LSD simulator on. <laughs> Steve, man, decent man. Well, this should be fun. All right. We might not ever see you again. Maybe not. You we might check in. in I'll, yeah, I'll be in Milwaukee, then Minneapolis, if you're looking for me. Take a wrong turn on the way. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, whatever. All right. Have a good time. Have a good trip. So to speak. So to speak, yeah. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Do blotter, man. You know, for sure. Can you play some uh, Hell in a Bucket for when uh, we're traveling, I'll man? I'll play yeah, dead music all the way out for okay. you. Okay. You know. All right. Doing right. That. What, a, what a great job, see? <laughs> mm-hmm. And what's your name again? I'm sorry. Oh, I'm Gary. No. <laughs> Denise? Denise. Denise. Okay. All right. Got my notes. I'm ready to go. Your notes? What yeah. I've talked. Sit next to Denise, <laughs> number one. <laughs> I've talked to some people that have been to the concerts, and they've been giving me some uh, information about what's happening. Gary, I can call and get the set list That's from right. last night anytime Why I want. Why don't you do that when and we're rumors, tra- tour rumors. Yeah, we're traveling. <laughs> don't worry, I will. <laughs> yeah, it's a whole dead show. But make sure you bring enough batteries for the phone. Yeah. It might even have a cigarette lighter plug, plug in yeah. thing. All right. I don't think so. No, no cigarette, cigarette lighter. Cigarette lighter. Yeah. Okay. You've got the hole for it, though, right? You got the hole for Isn't it. Isn't there a I hole? I don't know if it's full. I don't know if it's connected. Oh, okay. Oh, well, well. you just got the thing. You know, you're still, yeah. Yeah, still, <laughs> I'm still working still on it. Still going through it, checking <laughs> stuff out. Okay. Well, thanks for coming down and getting him. How did uh, you get talked into this? Shemp talked you into it? Yeah. <laughs> this morning. Yeah. Shemp looks like an FBI agent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he, had the, he had the sunglasses on and a little ear thing and the antenna sticking out of his back. <laughs> Imagine what they think of me. Man, he's a narc. They think you're an old man. They think yeah. you're, you're their dad. <laughs> They're taking their dad to see their dad. Oh, well, how did this happen? <laughs> dad in Levi's. Yeah. Dad, hey take guys. off those Levi's, man. Hey Everybody's going to know you're just trying to fit in. Let's get down and boogie, guys. <laughs> hey, righteous. Hey, kids, let's get some popcorn. Dad, popcorn. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll talk to you later. Boy, I have not smelled patchouli oil in a while. <laughs> I'm doing like this you whole California... Mm, Flashback? No, I just like, I enjoy smelling ears. But yeah, I'm flashing back mm-hmm. heavily here. I want to go, uh, go lay on the beach right now All right. with a Rick's burrito between my legs. <laughs> okay, well, you'll be heading out to the Dead uh, concert yeah. uh, thanks to these fine people that came down. The chimp uh, somehow conned into yeah. uh, picking you up. Are, are any of you from Chicago? No. Not directly, huh? No. Just kind of all traveling around with the band? Yeah. You're... Now, the band, they don't camp out in the parking lot with you. Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> They're at the hotel, yeah. In luxury suites, yeah. 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 But they send little, uh, they send press releases telling you to clean up your mess. Oh, we clean up. Oh, that's good. Recycling is active. Day. Hey, leave nothing but footprints, my man. I know. Yeah, City right. fathers will come down yeah. if you don't. Well, hey, the dead were the same. City streets might not be tell you right. Them anyway, so. Right. Say what? I said if they stayed in the parking lot, security would just hassle them anyway. Yeah, for sure. Because, yeah. Orange meanies. The orange meanies are out there. I'm going to really be bummed. Just, Whoa, man. I'm feeling like about 100 years old right now. Abby Hoffman, I'm coming to join you. All right. We'll uh, be back in a minute. AM 1000, Steve and Gary, and Gary's traveling companions. And uh, <laughs> don't forget to listen to the music play, for have, sure. Have a great don't forget day. Have a grateful day. Thank you. <laughs> Don't forget to buckle up, Gary. I'm going to be out. buckled up. No seatbelts. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> now, AM 1000 presents a special Grateful Dead update with Bob Weir, lifetime and founding member of the Grateful Dead. Bobby? Hi, I'm Bobby Weir with the Grateful Dead. I need a miracle every day, but that doesn't mean I get one. You probably don't either. Let's say you'd like to come to our show tonight, but you don't have a ticket. Simply showing up won't make it happen. If you do get a ticket that way, it'll almost certainly be a counterfeit. Meanwhile, you'll be adding to the crowds and debris which make your city fathers so uneasy. So, if you don't have a ticket, it doesn't make real good sense to come around. If you do come, don't deal with scalpers or leave litter, or do anything that makes us unwelcome in your town. We're all in it together. Let's keep it working. Damn straight, Bobby. Like Mr. Weir said, let's keep the garbage out of tonight's show. If you must relieve yourself, do it responsibly. Public urination stinks. The Grateful Dead need your assistance if they're to professionally pull your money out of this market. So come on, keep trucking. And remember, the 60s are making a comeback. 
right on. This has been a special Grateful Dead update on your All Dead station, AM 1000. Hey, hey, dude. Hello? Are you in the micro bus? I'm so wasted. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Did you at least get to sit next to the woman? <laughs> I'm in the uh, front seat. Uh, yeah. they're, they're camped out in back. Yeah. Okay. And we've got the incense burning. Uh-huh. And a little traffic report. As soon as we got on the Kennedy at Ohio, it stopped and go already. Really? Yeah. Do they want to listen to the radio? Yeah, they wanted to turn on a giant boom box, but... I can uh, take the delay off if you want. Uh, oh, you mean you want to listen to the station? Oh, okay. Well, I thought I would they were going to jam. I would hope they would want to <laughs> listen to the station. Okay, yeah, why don't you take us off delay, and then they can turn on the box, and I can hear you better. There you go, dude. Good. Okay, we're officially uh, we're officially ready now. <laughs> Got some nice beads in front of me on the glove box. Yeah. All right. Got some bubbles. I might want to blow some bubbles later. <laughs> Got some palms in the... Uh, are those palms? Uh, it's wheat. It's wheat? We got some wheat in case we're stranded. You can make your own bread. <laughs> make our own bread on the Kennedy. Make bread, not war. For sure, dude. Oh, boy. We just opened the glove box. Uh, are there cops around? Because I don't want them to see this. <laughs> what? We've got some mushroom candles. mushroom candles. We'll have to light those up later. Uh, some strawberry candies. Oh, don't, something to look. Is this a don't take any candies, Gary. Wow, I've got a kaleidoscope or something that makes multiples of everything. That wow, would, that would be a kaleidoscope, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I'm so wasted. Like those? Well, maybe not a kaleidoscope. It, it, uh, it's not uh, like the kaleidoscope. That like has the those. glasses that you used to be able to buy. Remember those? Yeah. With the, with the multiple images like that. Yeah. 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 I've got a stuffed uh, animal called Wilbur. It's a pig for peace. It's piggy peace. Well, that's nice. Okay, they're just handing me stuff left and right now. But <laughs> I don't know what to do. I think you should go back and sit next to the woman. <laughs> that's what I would do. They're, they've got a little bed or something back there uh, in the back of the van. I forgot how turned on I am by that look. <laughs> that that look. I mean, you know, with the long skirt and everything, that real peasanty look. Okay, I'm going to wear that tomorrow for you. No, though. no, really, though. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. I mean, what, what, ask her what, 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 like... Like, what's your skirt made out of? What's your skirt made out of? 100% cotton made in India. 100% cotton made in India. Yeah. Okay, and then she's got, like, a cool, like, an Indian kind of blouse on, too, right? Doesn't she? Yeah. 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 I and mean, it's just, like, a really... Uh, just a good look. You know, that very natural hippie look. <laughs> you know? And then she's got that little, like, that little uh, pierced nose thing there. Uh -huh. Man. Yeah, it's, a, it's the look. And the long hair, and... Man. I, I think we're going to see Steve at the concert And tonight. then she's got the big shoulder bag. You know, the big shoulder bag and uh -huh. everything. I was noticing Denise's uh, shoes as we were leaving the studio. I didn't oh, wait, there are uh, sandals. You've got some kind of leg warmer on. Oh, I, didn't, I missed that. Yeah, socks and then leg war or, um, sandals over that. It's very nice. Wow. And Jeff, he's wearing, of course, the vest. I don't care about Jeff. I care about Denise. <laughs> I'm sure we're only going to be pulled over three or four times on the way there. <laughs> yeah. In your micro bus. Yeah. 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 No problem. Oh, boy. Mm. Ask her if she believes in free love, because that was all part of that. And... Denise, free love? Um, there is a health crisis, you know. Health crisis. All right. It, all right. If... Ask that guy... Ask that guy who, to be quiet. I don't want to hear that free love or free sex stuff from him anymore. <laughs> if he wants to really be a hippie, then he knows what I'm talking about. Is that free love or free sex? You can hear him? It's, yeah. It's sex, <laughs> you numbskull. <laughs> is that free love or free sex? Because love is everywhere, man. It's beautiful. That's right. Yeah. Listen, if this uh, phone craps out, and it might because I noticed the wire is, is just kind of hanging. Oh, great. Uh, I, I had a hard time calling you back. Uh, you'll know why if you don't hear from me. Okay. Okay? That'll be the only reason? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's one of the that'll reasons. Be, that'll be the reason that we tell Greg. Yeah. Okay. I'm holding the battery pack uh, in a certain way, and that's the only way I can dial you. You got some electrical tape? You got some electrical tape? Okay. Decent. Well, 
It's tie-dye electrical tape. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Everything's colored. Brightly colored. Yes. Well, we're just stopping going to Kennedy in the microbus. Speaking of colored, are there black uh, Grateful Dead uh, heads? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Because I bet the tie-dye colors really stand out. I mean, really show up nicely on them. A lot of uh, black Dead heads? Yeah. Many of them, yeah. Huh? Rastafarian. Rastafarian. Oh, decent. <laughs> so. I mean, guys who don't bother to comb their hair. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Cool. I mean, and, and that would... That would sort of go, I mean, none of them seem to really, so. And not that I'm a big advocate of combing hair, really, I guess. That's I, your style, I think. I don't, you know? I don't comb mine either, but I wash it once in a while. Th and there we differ a little bit. Mm -hmm. There we differ. So, d don't you feel like they're dad right now? Um, driving out to Kennedy? <laughs> a little bit. Don't you want to talk to them about what college they're going to go to? Yeah. So... Shem tried to get a couple of the uh, older deadheads, but uh, they're uh, immobile, basically. He was there kind of early for them. It was 11.30. Yeah, they but he, he said they don't they don't move. They just stay in their chair until the show, and then they go inside. Yeah. They're a little too toasted to be driving around. You well, know? That's well, why they caravan, I think. So they can switch. Uh, well, they, and they can follow each other. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Sort of like pachyderms. Uh-oh. Right. We, we just got some condoms from a guy in a van. <laughs> They're tie-dyed. They're, uh, the Triumph condoms that uh, we've heard about. Are they tie-dyed? Uh, they look very psychedelic. Um, now ask her about free love, and if that guy says, do you mean love or sex, kick him out! <laughs> you mean love or sex, dude, because, like, love is everywhere. You know? <laughs> sex is not. <laughs> yeah, I know that. That's why I'm asking about it. Hold on, okay? Okay. All right. They're green. Are they tie-dyed? Are they tie-dyed? Uh, They're green? Uh, they're green. That's a start. Maybe we can soak them later. Ever made love to a Martian? <laughs> the jolly green giant. Yeah, that's the way mine looked after my vasectomy. So that would have they would have matched. They, they, those would be good for St. Patrick's Day too. Yeah, we should. For your shillelagh, the shillelagh cover. Hold on, okay. Well, call me back. Okay. All right. And one thousand. Stephen Gary. Gary on his way out to see the Grateful Dead with a, a bunch of twenty-year-old kids dressed like hippies. <laughs> And uh, I'm here, and I, I feel safe here, and I think I'm going to stay here. All right, uh, Gary's <laughs> Grandpa Gary is on the Kennedy on his way out to uh, to the Rosemont Horizon with a phone that doesn't appear to be working. So it could make uh, make for kind of a long afternoon for the Stever, but hey, is that him? Hey, dude. Hi. Uh, I just did some. Did work you get the, on the electrical? Phone. Did you get the electrical tape, got man? Got the tape. We got our Swiss Army knife out, and I did a little surgery, and I think we'll be good for the rest of the afternoon. Okay, good. If I have any problem at the horizon, I'll go inside and use a phone there. Okay. But uh, so far, so good. We're coming up to Hamlin, and uh, it is stop and go. So pace yourself. Okay. Now, uh, who, what's the name of the guy who's driving the micro bus? What's Jeff. His name? All right. Jeff said he was trying to decorate the bus. Um, I'll tell you what we have here. Uh, I've never seen this. It's a skull with a smile face on top of the skull. A smile your face. A what? A smile your face. Smile your face? That little thing in the back, do you see the, the skull with the uh, lightning bolt in the head? Yeah, I know that one. That's called a steal your face. Okay. It's uh, from the album cover called Steal Your Face. I'm familiar with that one, but this one on the side with the smile face? Right, it's a smiley face because it's got a smiley face instead of a lightning bolt. On the skull, man. On the skull. Don't you know anything about the dead? I, I didn't know as much as I thought I did. <laughs> well, I just learned that yesterday. Okay, see? He just learned it yesterday. When he bought it. Did right. you buy it yesterday? Yeah. From, from some burnout <laughs> with a five-foot-long... Nice girl. <laughs> some, some burnout with a five-foot-long Rasta, Rastafarian beard <laughs> with, with, with a bunch of earrings in it. Some other stickers. Hey, man. Steve, another uh, T-shirt that I'll be looking for, one that says, just say N-T-O. N-T-O. N-T-O? Yeah. That's the nitrous oxide uh, chemical uh, breakdown. N-T-O, right. Just say N-T-O. Is there another one? Just say no, K-N-O-W? Just say K-N-O-W, sure. Steve used to work at that radio station, by the way. Yeah. Another shirt uh, I think I'm going to get you, Steve. Mm -hmm. 
my country invaded Central America and all I got was this lousy T-shirt. Okay. Decent. <laughs> and one I'm going to get for your kids. It's uh, Fred Flintstone smoking something. Uh, Grateful Fred from bedrock to dead rock. Yabba dabba doobie. I'm sure there's no copyright violation there. <laughs> uh-uh. No. You can stay in this lane for a while. How's the driving? Is it, does, does he seem to be a safe driver? So far. Yeah? Yeah. Of course, you're stop and go, so. Uh, he just got this micro bus a few weeks ago. Remember, he told us, and it's stick in, in stop and go traffic. It's it's kind of a pain. Has he stalled at it at all? Just a couple times. Yeah. But S- hey. Still getting the hang of a stick? Sure. Yeah. Sure. That'll happen. How you doing? Decent. <laughs> a lot of good vibes out here. Yeah. Okay. Where are you now? We're coming up to that Magic Kiss sign. Does it really smell like patchouli oil in the minivan right now? What kind of incense are we burning? We got. We got hey, some... I dig her, man. I got to tell you something. We got some floral blend incense. You're on that, right? Uh, or a Shika. You're on that, right? What? You're on that, right? On what? I'm on, on a Kennedy. That's all I'm on right now. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> She's hot. And I think she can be swayed by capitalism. She's putting patchouli oil, oil on me right now. Is she? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm ready to concert. I'm ready. Because I think there, there, there's, even though they don't admit it, there must be some sort of love of capitalism <laughs> or they wouldn't idolize the dead so much. I mean, because look, these guys are like the ultimate capitalists. They do hardly anything, and, I mean, the return is unbelievable. Man, you're putting some bad vibes No, in I'm there. not. I'm just, but I'm really? just saying... I'm saying at some point, would it be so bad if your platinum card flopped out of your wallet? Who, out of Jerry's wallet or mine? No, out of, out of yours, onto, onto her... Uh... I don't have a platinum card. <laughs> All right. <laughs> your gold card. I've got my Elvis... Your Elvis master, card. My Elvis master on, card. Onto her, onto her big satchel. Would <laughs> it be so bad? Um, do they take charge cards at the various stands in the parking lot? No. No, they don't. Okay. Yeah, man, we, they, we don't want to pay the 4% to MasterCard. We're getting ready to make that split where the Kennedy and uh, the Eden split. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Cool. That's our update. <laughs> cool. And it's splitting uh, where it should split? I don't want you splitting ahead of schedule. No, we're, we're doing it as it should be done. Okay. All right. Very cool. You want to uh, take a break or anything? Me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were talking to them. I'm going to get out and stretch my legs while we're moving. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, actually, uh, yeah, I think we should. You know, we got a lot of 10th anniversary songs in. We might want to play more than a couple a day at this point to catch up. Okay. I think Rick carted up a bunch today. Yeah. Okay. And just let me know when you want me to call back. I'll be listening. Hey, we made it. Okay. Okay. So you're going to work on her, right? <laughs> I'll call you back. Right? Okay. Okay. Okay, bye. Bye. I mean, you got to figure at some point after driving around with a bunch of guys in a micro bus for two weeks with no money, you know, a guy with a job, a little money in the wallet, it's going to start looking good. That's what I've based my whole life on. I got Janet, didn't I? AM 1000.